Bom dia, amigos. It's another beautiful day. We already have 21 degrees. In the sun, it's pretty hot. It feels like 26. So today we are on our way to the Trollstigen. Norway is one of the most incredible countries I've met. For bikers, like Portugal, like, like Spain, like everywhere in the world. <laughs> we take the ferry across the Nordalsfjorden to Valdal. Morning! My alarm. No. Nope. Next, this. Okay. I recommend you switch off your alarm. It's a very annoying sound during the crossing. Many people forget. Yesterday I was pretty exhausted. The curves have been sometimes pretty hardcore in my eyes. Beautiful. It's amazing here in Norway. Uh, it has now 24 degrees. A few kilometers behind it was 19. And what I found out is the people at the camping pla places are so grumpy. They smile, I say good morning, how are you? And everyone is like, what do you want? <laughs> Sorry, that's me. Oh, Edpen. Nice. Oh, tons of strawberries, look! Good Brands Jovet can be reached via an iron footbridge. It is a 5 meter wide and 20 to 25 meter deep gorge. It is about as deep below the water surface as it is above. The water here has formed deep glacial mills and bizarre formations. According to legend, the gorge was named after a man who had stolen his bride in the 16th century. While fleeing, he jumped over the narrowest part of the gorge. Gudbrand was then declared an outlaw. It is not known whether he was able to take his bright with him when he jumped over the gorge it's amazing we just have been on a place with a waterfall and a river and it was 26 degrees and now we have 19 it's just a few kilometers this is up and down and up and down this is oh, wow <laughs> I think wow is my favorite word on that trip very pretty. Look the houses with the oh, oh my god! <laughs> this is cute. Beautiful. We ride along the beautiful Waldatswegen, which is part of Provincial Road 63, towards Trotsky. Unbelievable. This is beautiful. We müssen da anhalten. Ich muss meine Drohne auspacken. Sorry. Fatty. Da unten halten wir aber an.
the Trollstigen has a gradient of about 12% and leads on the section of the Golden Route in 11 hairpin bends from Isterdalen up to the top of the pass from where we descend. The name Trollstigen, the letter of the Trolls, comes from a Norwegian legend. It says that the mountains in the area were trolls with bushy hair made of roots and moss and with big noses and small eyes. They were once turned into stones by the sun. They were considered evil and dangerous creatures that were kept away by church bells. In the middle of the serpentines is the 320 meter high waterfall Stigfossen. This waterfall divided the important route between Ondalsnes and Valdal into two halves and was difficult to access until 1936. When the bridge was built, the route was open to traffic. It's so terrible. This is really terrible. Oh. Oh. Sorry, my sleeping. Ich hab's nicht gesehen, ich war zu nah. Der Speicher ist voll. <lacht> Wolltest du anhalten, Foto machen? Dann lass uns da drüben parken. Ups. Ha? Fahr zu? Okay. Ja, weil er da steht. <sighs> Terrible. Maybe if, if you go also on the other side. Oh. 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 Awesome. Oh, great. Thank you guys. <laughs> Thank you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh my. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> How stupid. Ich muss meinen Spiegel reparieren. Hast du kein Foto mehr gemacht? Das war absolut ein Foto wert. <lacht> Wenn ich von meinem Moped runtergekommen wäre, ja. Aber ich konnte nicht so stehen bleiben. Ich muss wieder gucken, wo kann ich stehen. Ja, ja, schon klar. Ja, Gott sei Dank, die waren total lieb. Also das war wirklich sehr lieb. Und ich hab's auf meiner Kamera. Supposedly, the trolls also have their nice sides and once helped to build churches, such as the cathedral in Trondheim, with their hands, which only had four fingers. Christianity, however, demonized the trolls, whose existence was still believed in until the 19th century, but only with horror and fear. We ride along the East Jordan to Eidsbrückda. It's a paradise for fishermen. As you can buy wine in supermarkets in Norway, we drive to Ondals Nest to a wine shop. During the week, sales are only permitted until 8 p.m as there is a drink drive limit of 0.2 and the fine is 1200 euros upwards, we extend our stay and enjoy a day off. <laughs> 